Hello guys, what is up? It's Christian and Noah's Fun Toys TV here, back with another video. I'm Christian, and today I'm going to show you my Mickey Mouse figure shelf and some other things in my collection. Now, I've only been collecting Mickey Mouse for about a year and a half, and this is where it's gotten me. And um, also in my room, I've got this big plush shelf, so yeah. That, and that gotten far with the Donald Duck puppet too. Alright, so let's get into this video. Alright, so first we're gonna start out with some of like um McDonald's toys. So right here we got um one of the Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway toys. We ha this one is the Hollywood Tower Hotel. And um I also have the Goofy um I think that's Snow Map I don't know what is it? I've never been to Disney but I'm going Going this year, so I don't think you can see it. It's Everest, yeah. Same thing. <laughs> um, there's also the train Goofy, which is one of the common ones. I also have Minnie and Mickey in their car, and then I also have the Space Mickey right there. And um, I know I have a ton of McDonald's toys. Like I also have this like it's like another train thing. His arms would go up and down if you move him. And um, surprisingly. This figure here in the back, if I can pull him out, but that one right there is a McDonald's toy. Same with that mini right there. And um, these two little cars here are McDonald's toys, but this one's got the wheels and it can actually work. This one doesn't. Oh, hold up. Okay, and um, also that King Mickey right there, one right there. Um, he is a Burger King toy, so yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, tagging along with that, we have these, um, cup things from these Juicy Juice things. I just buy them because they're cool. They also got the, um, Silver Mickey over there. And I don't know why, but there's this goofy Roadster's bottle that I made, like, two years ago or something. I don't know. So, we also have, oh yeah, there's another one. Um, I'm just gonna go through some regular figures, and yeah. So, right here we have, um, Millie, right here. It's a, I got it from the dollar store. It is a very nice figure right here. You don't see Millie and Melody figures anywhere, really. Because they're not too famous. And, in the same set, I also have a little Cuckoo Loco figure. Which, um, I adore very much. I also have this Cuckoo Loco keychain. I also got it at the dollar store. So, um, down here we have a little Mickey on a train. Which was actually from one of our videos called Mickey and Minnie Ride a Train to Go Get Some Ice Cream. We used the dollar store Minnie Mouse figure. I don't know where that one is. I, mean, I think I do. It might be behind my washer. But, yeah, I've kept the Mickey. My grandma got it for me. Thank you, Grammy. So, yeah, he is very nice. So, I also have some Lego minifigures. We have this Minnie Mouse one. We have Mickey, and I also have the little bird in the set. Like right here. Yeah, he was hard to find in that. All those Legos. I also have one of my favorite figures back there. So... Here is this one. He is, um, I don't know when he was made, but he just gives me such a good vibe to him. And, I don't know, I've just always adored this figure, and he's always made me pumped up to collect some other Mickey stuff. I'm hopefully trying to find more Mickeys like this, because it reminds me of the Mickey Mouse shorts, um... Also, The Wonderful World, The Mickey Mouse, which is on Disney+. Plus. Um, so, yeah, he re reminds me of that, and I really like it. Alright, next we have um, some of my glass figures over there. I also have another McDonald's two toys in the bag. I also have the Pluto one. So, let's get into the glass figures. And Oh, first, um, here's this, uh, like, I don't know, 1950s Mickey figure. Um, I got him at, um, flea market for, like, three bucks, so I had to grab him. Because you don't see stuff like this anymore. 
Alright, on to the glass figures. This is probably my rarest item out of my whole collection. This is a 1930s porcelain glass Mickey Mouse figure. And it does have some things that said made in Japan, I think. Let me see. Yeah, I think so. But, yeah, he's official. Um, my aunt got it for me at her work, and I'm just so amazed that I had this. When I started collecting, I was really into getting those, like, 1930s stuff, 1929. But I never got my hands on one because they're so expensive. But my aunt, I think she only got this for, like, a couple bucks or something. So that was really good. So, yeah, there's my 1930s Mickey. We also have this Mickey, which is, um, you know what? He's got some stickers here at the bottom. 1950 Walt Disney Productions. So, this thing is pretty old. Um, he was made about, let's see, 50... About 72 years ago or something. I'm not sure. But, yeah, that's really old. So, next we have some not really old things, but still old because it's in Japan. And it's, from, it's from Disney World just because of the label there. It says Disney. So, this is a, um, who, I don't know, Conga Mini. I'm not sure. But, this figure is really, really nice. And I'm lucky to have this, because I just found it at an antique store and needed to buy it. So last for the glass figures is this small little Mickey, which is one of my favorites because, um, wow, he's just been through a lot. He's, um, crashed on the floor before he's broken. Thank you to my grandma for fixing him. But... This is a really important one to me. Alright, back to the figures. Alright, for the end of this video, I'll just go through some quick things. Like this Mickey uh, sprinkler. We got the Mickey um, McDonald's um, box. We got a Mickey Mouse Pez. We got a Goofy McDonald's toy there. We got a Mickey um, vinyl figure. Got one of these um, Disney showcase or whatever they're called. Mickey Funko Pop back there, Kingdom Hearts Mickey figure, not that one right there, there's one in the box. Got an old Mickey pencil sharpener, um, the chocolate milk from the Mickey Mouse thing, don't worry, it was empty and cleaned out. And I also have this like one waltz away Mickey thing. Yeah, all of these figures are really cool, but the only last one I want to go over... It's probably this one that I pulled from a blind bag. First time getting that blind bag, I pulled the Mickey. I wasn't even collecting at the point, so. That is it for my Mickey Mouse figure collection. Hope you guys enjoyed, and make sure to subscribe and like if you want more Mickey Mouse-related content. Bye!